All righty. Good evening. Good morning. Good afternoon, everybody. We are extremely, extremely excited to have each and every one of you here in this Zoom this evening. My name is Cedric Harris, and it is my pleasure to be your co-host here on this Zoom here this evening. Maybe you were invited to the Zoom today by myself, by a friend of yours, a business partner, a coworker, someone who actually cares about you, that wanted to share some information with you that could possibly change a lot of things inside of your life. And we're not about any hype here. We're literally about giving you facts and giving you some information that we know that is pertinent to your success inside of the cryptocurrency world. So I'm excited to be able to co-host this Zoom for you. We all know that it's the day before Thanksgiving. We all know that a lot of you have family in town. Some of you are looking at this Zoom right now. Please don't burn the turkey because I don't want you to blame it on me. Some of you are working on the sweet potato pie and that pumpkin pie and some chitlins and some casserole and some biscuits and all that good stuff. I know, I know, I know. Save me a plate because I get a little hungry. But here's what we're going to do. We're not going to keep you here for a significantly long time. That's not what we're going to do. We want to jump right into some facts for you and share some information with you that we know that a lot of you are excited about. So what I'm gonna do is we're gonna play a little bit of ping pong here. I've got a couple of really, really good friends of mine that are on this Zoom here in conjunction with the other 135 of you that are on this Zoom on a Wednesday, the day before Thanksgiving. Truly, truly excited and humbled that you trusted us to be on this Zoom here when I know that a lot of you are with your family and some of you are traveling and some of you might even be in your car on Zoom. So just be careful as you are listening. What I am going to tell each and every one of you is this. If you could, grab a pen, grab a pad. There might be a, a couple of notes that you might want to take along the way. This Zoom is being recorded. So it is being recorded. However, I'm not going to be sending it out tomorrow. I'm not going to be sending out the Zoom recording tomorrow. So just pay close attention to everything that you see here tonight. And we're going to get started. So a lot of you have heard about this phenomenal project called True Badger. Some of you have heard about this phenomenal project called Insights. Some of you have heard about this phenomenal project called Catapult Swap, okay? You're gonna learn about all of them tonight. All of them, we're gonna shed some light on here tonight. But the first thing that I wanna share with you is this. Inside of the cryptocurrency space, I've been lucky enough to be inside of this space since 2017. And I can tell you that it's very rare. It is extremely rare to be able to have a live Zoom with co-founders and CEOs of a particular cryptocurrency coin. Typically, what ends up happening is, is that you cross your fingers. You don't know who's behind the project. And today, you're going to find out who's behind these projects. You're going to find out what these projects are all about and how you can participate inside of the project. So we're going to start off with my good friend that I just met here a little while back, someone that I should have met two years ago, but I'm going to go ahead and take it right now in the time that we have. He is the CEO of True Badger, someone that is full of integrity, someone who understands the cryptocurrency space, someone that today, today alone, when we talk about working, when we talk about being committed to the community, today alone, I believe I heard the number was 27, I think it was, I don't know, 27 Zooms today, 20 plus Zooms today, that's how busy he has been today with his partners. A lot of you have been inside of different Zoom rooms as well, getting set up with this coin. We're gonna talk about that as well. But it's my pleasure to have on the stage here with us, CEO of True Badger, Mr. Peter Gantner. Peter, how you doing this evening, my friend? Great, great. Well, thank you. Um, first of all, thank you, Cedric. It's been phenomenal working with you here over the last uh, month and a half or so as we've been working together, putting this together. I'm grateful that you were willing to share it with the people that you have influence and that are friends with your partners in this world, right? Helping create great stuff in the, in, out there in the space. Um, cryptocurrency, guys, is going to be the biggest economic shift in the history of mankind to this point, right? It is the biggest opportunity for people to be a part of. And I believe it's each of our responsibility once you find out about crypto to go out and share it with as many people as you can and get as many people involved. I want to try to shorten it up a little bit tonight because it is the evening before Thanksgiving. And I know that people do have family in town and they do have to get those pies in the oven. Otherwise, it's not going to be, go very well tomorrow if you don't have that 
famous dessert sitting there when everybody comes over to eat. And there's a lot of people traveling uh, to get there. So, um, and Cedric hit on one of the most important points that we're going to kind of jump to this point, and it is. Um, I got involved in crypto, buying crypto, doing stuff. And, and I believe there's three things that you really need in order for a project to be successful, right? You need a good team that you know is going to be able to pull it off. You need the community behind it and you need the technology. Well, the problem was, is most of the projects out there, you don't know whether it's the most brilliant business person, the most brilliant uh, you know, computer programmers out there that are behind it, or is it just people that know how to make a pretty website? Because they're not telling you who they are. You can't look at it and say, you know, it's kind of like, hey, you know, and I'll put it in this perspective. You have a uh, need a root canal and you go to the dentist and they roll in this black curtain area and they say, look, we're not going to let you know who the dentist is. We're not going to give you his credentials. We don't even know if he's a real dentist. All we know is they're going to drill and fix your teeth and hopefully it's going to come out pretty well you're probably gonna jump out of the chair and run as fast as possible, right? So that's one of the keys to the Nexus ecosystem and True Badger is we're going to help find and put together and facilitate the launch of token projects that we know at least that there's a team behind it that has some people that understand how to build businesses, that understand how to build community, that understand the technology and have a vision for the long term in the crypto space. Even some of the people that I believe know what they're doing, they have a very short view of what they can make in this bull run. That's what they're focused on is how much can I make in this bull run? Not when the real opportunity for crypto that comes in in the blockchain, which is over the next five or 10 years. Fortunes will be made for the people that have that long-term vision and that are able to find teams find the right projects, make sure that they have utility. And the best way to explain utility out there, guys, is it has a purpose to exist and it can charge money for the services or generate revenue from the services that they provide because people are willing to pay to participate with it, right? They need to use it on an ongoing basis. All of the projects that we look at have those, that, these aspects to it a team behind it, the utility. And of course, we're building the community side of it because it's one of the most important things in crypto. So um, Cedric, how you want me to just kind of go through things a little bit shorter than normal? How much time do we want to spend on here tonight? Just let's, give me a let's, time. Let's, let's spend, you know, 45 minutes or less tonight. You know, I kind of want to, you know, let's let's hit on, you know, the, the the True Badger project. Let's hit on the Insight project. But then let's definitely try to spend majority of the time on, on the Kettlebolt project. And then, you know, we've yeah, got- Yeah, using uh, Safu Five, right? So yeah, guys, just Safu so you know, I, I, I don't like the fear of loss ever, but we do have a project that's launching on the 30th. And if you want to participate, you need to be registered by Saturday night because that's the process that we go through. So that's what we'll cover. So we'll briefly go over the ecosystem and then we'll spend a lot of time going through how you can participate in Safu Five. The last launch we did, and these are firm numbers, guys. Um, the, in the first phase of our launch, people were able to participate with one BNB. That today is worth over $1,700. So they took $430 at that time and they turned it into over $1,700, and that was four weeks ago. And that's the worst of anybody who participated. That's not the best. That's the worst on that side of it with NSI. So it's a major opportunity, and we'll get into Safu Fi. So True Badger, guys, is our base token. Think of True Badger as a consulting organization that understands how to launch tokens. It understands the technology. It is able to vet teams, and that's what it is. It's our base token. It helps with some funding. And it's the core of building the community for the other projects, for this Nexus ecosystem. The way that we do that is, and I saw somebody put in the notes, hey, they went on the Zoom and they helped walk them through getting their wallet set up and getting that stuff done. We're one of the only projects I know of, official projects, not people that are helping friends and family or maybe business associates get into the crypto space. We're the only organization that I know of that have live Zooms that will walk people through and that have built an onboarding system 
to help get people into the crypto space in the way that we have done um, in moving forward. Um, that we literally have no no cost to this, right? This is something that you can come through. They're going to get you on there. And maybe we can briefly show that before we get off here. So one of the, our goals is, True Badger's goal is to build the largest, most effective uh, community in the crypto space that then will go on and support the projects that are coming through as the consulting project. It is in the marketplace today. Corey can maybe pull up the charts real quick. Uh, it's at about a $33 million market cap. It is tradable on the, on the Binance Smart Chain through PancakeSwap, and it has very good liquidity, uh, right around $3 million in BNB liquidity and a matching $3 million in True Badger liquidity. All of our projects, there, we don't do closed projects, guys, where it's, you know, you put money in and then you have to wait, right? All of our projects within a uh, day or two of launching are on PancakeSwap or whatever chain they'll end up being on because we'll start working with some of the different chains. Do you see that, what buddy? Are, yes, we got it. Yeah, we okay. got it. Thank you. One of the things that you'll see that's a little bit different than the tokens that we launch are they have great first days and then uh, they stay great. Right? It continues to go. The chart doesn't go straight up and it doesn't go straight down. See, True Badger solves problems that exist in the industry. So us as crypto enthusiasts and, and people that were trading in cryptocurrency, we got a little frustrated with some of the problems we were running up against. And one of those problems where we'd get involved in early stages of tokens, the first day launch, bots would come in and manipulate the heck out of the price, falsely drive up the price by doing what's called front running, going in and placing uh, uh, purchases just above the price each time of what people were trying to do it, bringing up that price only to when it got close to the top and they were done front running, selling off all their tokens and then watching the price tumble down to 60, 70, 80% less than what I just possibly just bought into, causing me to go into a negative situation. We built a site called Catabolt Swap, which is where the token on the 30th will be launching, guys. So you need to get registered with it if you want to participate in it. We'll get into a little bit more details. But this is our own site that we built. Now, this is not like a normal swap. You can't come here and swap tokens every day. We do launches on here specifically geared to one project at a time. So we can make sure that we stop the bots from getting in and being able to manipulate the price. Again, falsely driving that up. And, and why is that important? Really, guys, it's important for the long-term um, stability of a company because if I get involved in a company, let's say I look at a project, let's say it's Safufi, and I get excited about the technology, get excited about the value that it's going to provide in my life, and then I buy the token on the first day, and by the end of that day, I've lost 80% of my investment. I'm probably not happy with that project, as, or at least as happy as I was when I was excited about the technology. The loss will overshadow my excitement about the technology. So what you want to be able to do is get into projects that are going to be able to make their early adopters happy and glad that they got involved in that project. And that's what we're able to do with Catabolt Swap. And Corey will probably do a quick walkthrough on how to register. It's what I want to save most of the time for today. So if you say, yes, I want to get involved with this, go from there. So Catabolt Swap, so far we've launched two tokens. Uh, one of the tokens that we launched on it is a token called Insights. So Corey's going to jump into that. Insights, if you look, again, phenomenal day, first day. Uh, look at that green candle. But look, it has not touched below that candle at any point since we launched this thing over a month ago. Hey, Peter, um, Peter, Peter hold, on, hold on one second. I, I, want, I, want to, I want to shed the light on something real quick. Hey, Corey, can you do me a favor and go back to the True Badger chart real quick? Just, just real quick. Just, just real quick. Okay. Does everybody see this chart? I want you to pay close attention to this. Like, you see day one, and just like Peter said, typically, you have coins that pop up when they launch, and then they pop right down because of manipulation. Okay? And I want you to see the steadiness of this coin. Do you, do you see that? Do you see the steadiness of that? Okay? If you see the steadiness of that and see what's going on, everybody type in the comment section sexy real quick. Just, just type sexy real quick, okay? Now, if you wanna put the Chris Brown, you know, YouTube video down there, feel free. But just type sexy real quick. Now, do me a favor, Corey. 
jump to the insights chart real quick. Jump to the insights chart. Now, this is the second coin that was launched. Do you all see this? See, one of the things that we're not doing here is pumping dumps. And I know that Peter is gonna shed the light on that, but I wanted to jump in here really quickly so you all can really truly see that this is about longevity and this is about keeping people sticky. So I had I had to jump in here real quick, Peter. So I apologize about that, but I wanted to- Oh, no, no, I appreciate I appreciate it 100%. Yeah, it's, it's important. You know, we're looking at these all day long while we're doing calls with people and stuff like that. To us, it gets to be like, well, this is the way it's supposed to be. Isn't everybody's token like this? And by the way, you guys are going to see the same results with Safu Fide when we launch within a, within the next four or five days. And the reason for this is we understand where the real true power of cryptocurrency, the blockchain is, and that is building solid community and bringing people on board, right? This onboarding process that we've done. We don't spend our money on fancy, uh, you know, YouTube crypto um uh, you know, promoters, uh, influencers, we invest our, our effort, our time, our money into building a community of people that are looking at this going, I want to be in the crypto space for the long haul. I want an area where I can find great projects. So, um, and if you've been in the crypto space, of course, you've heard the term rug pull. If you've been trading in the crypto space and you've gotten caught up in a rug pull, can you put a one in the space? In, in the chat. I know I got to put a one in there. <laughs> I, yeah, I, I was actually it. listening to a gentleman and it's this guy that in six months made $10 million in the crypto space. And he's talking along and he's talking about what he's doing. And they're talking about he's one of the great researchers in this space. Mm -hmm. He's absolutely just because he was a, a financial analyst who went over to the crypto space. And then he said something interesting. Yes, in that six months, he had gotten caught up in over 100 rug pulls, right? Because they couldn't look behind the curtain to see what was even going on, even somebody with that skill level. And so again, our job here is to interview. So we've been talking to projects, guys, uh, every day. Today, I think we had three different calls with it. Projects in green energy um projects in finance a whole new blockchain that was built on the light on the litecoin network that is its own standalone loan blockchain all of these teams are coming to us and we're beginning the process of us now you always have to do your own research i'm not a financial advisor i know cedric's not and i know Corey's not and joe's not right but what we are able to do is do that pre-work of making sure that these people that we're talking to, when they say, hey, I did this, they actually did it, right? Or I've worked with these people. We're able to do that initial, you know, if you're going to build a, a, a community, a chain with 50,000, 100,000 people in it, there's no way for all of those people to be able to bet it. And a matter of fact, if you go to Coin Market Cap, Corey, can you pull up Coin Market Cap real quick? I know it's not one we normally... But here is how overwhelming normally the crypto space is. And that is, if you look in that top left corner, 14,775 different tokens. How the heck could you ever research that many tokens and keep track of them and be a part of it? Um, when you look at the True Badger logo uh, right there behind me, it has the yellow light behind it. I call that our lighthouse, right? It's like there's a crypto storm out there and there's all of these, you know, scam projects and who knows behind them projects and honey pots and all of this crazy stuff going on. Ideas that maybe can't even be pulled off. People that are faking the fact of what technology they have available. And essentially True Badger is that lighthouse that's sitting there in the port that's where the sea is nice and calm and there's organization, and there's a system in place. We've all heard why franchising is so, so successful, right? Because there's systems in place that give it consistency. True Badger is that system within the crypto space that is going to help. I don't know if every project we do is going to be successful because nobody can guarantee that. But what I can guarantee is that you will not get in a rug pull 
if it's, a, if it's something coming through our system. You will not get into a honeypot. You will not have a team that's going to work on it for three or four weeks and then abandon that project and it not continue to move forward. So a lot of the problems that exist, guys, we eliminate those from that space. Imagine the gentleman who made $10 million in six months if he wouldn't have gotten wrapped up in 100 rug pulls. How much more profitable would he have been because every one of those rug pulls is an absolute loss of your cryptocurrency, right? You're going to lose your tokens when they do that. And there's all there's fast and slow rug pulls. So we've talked about that. Let's go back to insights real quick, buddy, because I want to show you guys. So we had Catapult. We launched the insight token. So there's the chart. Let's visit the site. What is insights? So insights, in order for projects to be successful, they need to have people that are trading in volume. Um, and daily volume on these projects for them to be successful. So holders are very important and we're building the community of holders, but as well, so are people that are trading that. In the DeFi space, especially on the Binance Smart Chain, there are a lot of different types of tokenomics out there. And the tokenomics is the, the, the uh, economics behind the token, right? How does it function? Is there a, a, a swap? fee on it when you swap in and out what are those percentages is the reflection is there staking on top of these things all of these different things and i know i'm speaking chinese i had somebody on sunday renounce me and say that i spoke multiple languages and i'm like what is he talking about and he said the second language is crypto right so if you're new to this you're like what the heck is he talking about rug pulls Last time I pulled the rug is when I was a kid and my brother was standing on it, right? And I made him fall down. I don't understand what that is. Just know that these are things that we want to avoid and we're creating the solutions to avoid people getting into those problems in there. And so Insights is a piece of software that are going to give traders the information that they need to make smart decisions. And we're actually going to show you one of these situations. So we have what's called a whale watcher on it. A whale is a large holder of tokens, right? There's a certain percentage of the tokens that are held by the largest holders. Imagine if you could get the inside information of what those holders were doing, those whales, whether they were selling or holding or whether they were buying. Uh, Corey's going to go back to True Badger real quick and he's going to show you a moment in the chart. There was a moment right there where we had two days, one day right there that was a sell-off, a day in between, and then another sell-off. Now, if I knew what was going on, so if you go back to the, to, to the insights, buddy, you will see that there was 15% of the whales that were buying. I was one of those whales that was buying. This is the analysis of that moment in our charts. Only 1% of the big holders were selling. So that was essentially four people selling off. 84% of the big people um, were holding their tokens. Now, these are who? The people that are the closest usually to the project, right? They know the most about what's going on. And then, of course, that 15% was a decent thing. I want you guys to think about this map. 15 times more whales were buying versus the number of whales selling. What does that tell you? If you looked at this, would you make the decision to sell or would you make the decision to buy or hold? Either buy or hold. That's the only decision to make here. Now, if this was re reversed in a different direction and maybe 15% were selling, uh, you know, 1% were uh, buying and then 84% were holding, maybe then you would make a different decision, right? From that side of it. You'd want to dig into it more. Insights will give you that information. Now, Insights is a decentralized trading platform. And what does that mean? That means you will hold the tokens in your wallet. And when you decide you want to trade utilizing Insights, because it will auto trade for you a little bit further down. This is launching. By the way, guys, this project is not launching in six months or a year. This project is in beta right now. And on December 1st, the features of this will be available for people to participate in. As we talked about Catabolt, that technology is already working. We're not building projects. We have a bunch that we're working on and we'll tell you more about those when they're ready. But we like to talk about projects and bring them to people when they're ready to go and ready to put it together. Uh, Mark put in, I want it tonight. 
So insights is going to give you that information. So what will happen is when you say you want insights to trade for you, you will actually take the tokens, load them up into a smart contract. The smart contract will execute the trade for you when it hits your percentage of gain that you want. And then you can, it'll execute the trade and then you can pull that back down from the smart contract. You're never giving your funds to another individual. It is completely decentralized trading platform that you're able to go in. And if you want to manually trade, you have the information to manually trade. And if you want it to auto trade for you, it will make those auto trades. So that's insights that are there. Now, how does this play into the Nexus ecosystem? Imagine us getting ready to launch a token and we have 50, 60,000 traders on NSI and we're able to expose them to the project after our base community has already been put into that token. How much volume can you create? How much of a run-up in that token could be created by saying, hey, look guys, here's a great token. Look at these charts on this token, they're fantastic. And then have it take off from there. So that's insights on that side of it. So now let's go, normally we go into Safu fight, but I wanna wait for that one for a hold. So uh, Cedric, any questions so far on, on where we're at with this, where we're at oh, in the presentation right now? No, you, good? You, you've hit the nail on the head. I just, I just wanna say this really quickly about insights. Corey, if you can go back to the page here really quickly, I wanna spend like 30 seconds on this. Do you all understand, the, do you all understand what Peter just said? Like you, it, it, this is literally giving you a crystal ball, right? Of what's going on in particular projects. Who's buying, who's selling? Do you all get that? If you see value in that, just type in yes inside the comment section. For those of you that have been rocking with me for a long time, you know I'm really big on class participation. Type in yes inside of the comment section, please. Because I'm telling you right now, that's those insights of, oh, well, this person is buying, this person is selling. And if you think about the chart that Corey pulled up and showed 1%, 15%, when you think about that, I'm like, okay, the chart went down some. Ooh, 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 do I sell? No. Anybody think? Corey, go back to that chart here really quickly. And anybody think, anybody think that when these people here, when you see that arrow, when they sold that chart, when they sold off, Anybody think they feel a little dumb right now? Just type LOL inside the chat. Just type in LOL. You think they feel a little dumb right now? It's like, hold on for a second. Like you sold just a tinge bit too early. Slow down, McFly. That's the power of this tool, ladies and gentlemen. That is just, if, if that doesn't get you excited, your wood is wet. I don't know what to tell you. Back over to you, Peter. Well, and I'm telling you what, I was one of the whales that were buying. So I'm sending them a Christmas card this holiday season because they're helping pay for Christmas, right? I was able to triple my money uh, by getting involved at that time. So, you know, again, I'm thanking them for, for making their decision. It might've been a bad one for them, but, you know, we were able to take advantage of that, get a whole bunch of new people into the token at a better, better, better bill. And of course that has turned into magic for us. Um, and moving forward. So the next one we're going to cover real quick, buddy, is CNP. So this is our entry into the NFT market, guys. We'll be doing both um, entertainment NFTs and financial NFTs. And I, I got to tell you, they are lining up at the door to participate with us in this NFT space. And I got to tell you, creative ways that NFTs are going to be used to take from a digital asset and a real world asset and marry those two together is absolutely unbelievable. Our first NFTs will be um, offered for pre-purchase in December. This project in January and February will be going fully live. And we're going to be doing some stuff in the NFT space that has not been done before. And now we're going to partner with a company that has built their own chain, not on somebody else's chain, their own chain that is on the uh, Litecoin network that we're going to help facilitate them launching that project, bringing it to the marketplace and being able to offer NFTs in that way. Absolutely. I'm telling you, when we started this, you know, five months ago, uh, today just blew me away. Um, 
we were talking with another project that we're working with and they started talking about the names of some of the people that are involved in the project and they go oh, yeah this guy's involved he has 40 million followers on social media and he's a part of the project and they're like well can you help us take our project to the marketplace we have another project we're working on they have over 5 million followers in their space and we've already worked on helping them launch their token and their project People are recognizing what we're building here, guys, and they're saying, this is where we want to be. This is where community is. This community doesn't just pump and dump and run and, you know, cash out of their tokens after they make a couple of bucks. We're here building something that's real and something that's here to stay. So that's our entry. This token is not available yet. And I'm going to tell you by holding true Badger tokens, when we do get closer to it, we do what's called snapshots of the wallet addresses. And we take five snapshots over the course of about a month before the token launches. Those five snapshots determine how we um, uh, uh, distribute a reward of the token that whatever we're launching. So if you hold True Badger token a month before CNP launches, you actually will get what's called a claimed airdrop. The claimed airdrop for NSI was an additional $1.5 million of NSI tokens that the True Badger token holders were able to claim and now have in their wallets and have the ability for that growth as well as the price of True Badger going up and what's called reflection. Don't want to get into a big discussion in that. Just know, guys, reflection is you get more and more tokens every single day. Your token balance grows of your True Badger and as well with insights on an ongoing basis. So now let's go to the star of tonight's call, which is Safufide. This one is huge, guys. If you've been in the space for a little while and you know a decent number of people, you have to know somebody whose wallet has been hacked, um, where they've lost their tokens because they either clicked, somebody sent them a link and said, hey, you need to click here for us to sync up your wallet or you know, I, we need your seed word so we can register your wallet or we, you know, I had one lady who went on Google and looked up MetaMask phone number because she wanted to talk to somebody. Of course, a phone number came up, but it was a scammer who had put out a fake phone number. When she called, they answered the phone, MetaMask Help Services, and then she uh, went ahead and gave them access to her wallet because she thought she was talking to MetaMask. And they emptied out our wallet just like that, right? So what we did is this project actually started as a project to help um, comp, uh, projects become DAOs. Again, I'm going to speak a little bit of uh, crypto ease, right? Which is a DAO is a decentralized autonomous organization. It essentially means the token holders are the owner of the project. That means the, pro the assets, the intellectual property, anything that is inside that project is owned by the people who hold tokens to it. And those token holders get a vote in how it is run. Our platform, Safufide, will allow them to, and this will be launching in the next couple of months, it will allow projects to come to us, set up a DAO, and then allow for their community to come to Safufide and use it as a voting platform in order for them to elect to move those. Another feature of it, which is what are called multi-sig wallets, um, was set up to protect the assets of projects for the token holders. So I had mentioned rug pulls. Rug pulls are when people take the assets that belong to the project, they sell them off, and they disappear and run off with all the money. Um, using multi-sig wallets, the companies that are working with us will be able to put multiple signers on a single wallet, utilizing other wallets to protect it, which will stop that from happening. It would be impossible for someone to use our services and then run off with the money by themselves in that respect. So we're, again, Finding problems and solving problems, bot manipulation, catapult, um, trading problems with these DeFi tokens, insights, people getting their wallets hacked and projects doing rug pulls, Safu fight. Again, solving huge problems. That's There's so much opportunity here, guys, in this space if you solve those problems and then build the community around them to make it happen, all right?
So Safufide is our next token that we're launching. This project will launch on Catapult Swap on November 30th. Um, we do what's called a fair and balanced launch, which lets the most people participate and then builds a solid foundation for the project, which then ensures those charts that we were just looking at, right? I can't wait to have three. It's cool enough when you're in a meeting with somebody and you're talking about token projects and you go, here's our two. Now I'm going to have three, you know, by, by, the, by the middle or the end of next week, I'm going to have three charts I can do. And it's just going to be incredible to be able to do it and say, hey, we've duplicated this over and over again. And it's not because of what we've done. It's because of the community we're building. Projects are looking for. So I was talking about the airdrops where you get tokens for holding them. The projects we bring through are not required to do that. However, the first project that we're doing that is our non-ecosystem, um, direct ecosystem project, they have offered to put up 3% of the tokens of that project to airdrop to True Badger holders. Now imagine project after project after project that looks at it and goes, holy mackerel, I want the participation of the greatest community in the crypto space on the face of this earth. And we are willing to give them tokens just for participating, just because they're part of that ecosystem and holding that base token. Imagine in a year having 30, 40, 50 tokens in your, in your wallet that you basically only held your true badge or kept getting reflection and ended up with another token and another token and a, oh, another $1 million, another 1.5 million in tokens distributed out there. This is what we're building and it's the ecosystem that we're building around it. So on Tuesday, which is November 30th, this is the platform that we will be launching Safu Fight on, okay? It only launches one token. You can't buy the wrong one. You can't get a wrong contract address. It is, it's, 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 it's completely scam proof from those perspectives because we only have one token on there and that's what you're going to be able to do. But in order to participate on that Tuesday, to keep the bots out, you must come here by Saturday at midnight PST, so 11.59 PST, and register your wallets in order to be able to participate. And Corey, real quick, buddy, do you want to walk them through how to do that real quick? First of all, I want to do something, guys. Whenever you go to a crypto website, you visit the website. The first thing I want you to do is look at the address bar and go letter by letter and make sure you are on the right site. Some people took pancake swap, they put an extra letter in there, and they literally stole hundreds of thousands of dollars in crypto. So you want to make sure you have the right address and make sure that that lock is to the left-hand side, that it's a secure site and you're on the right site. So once you've gone to catapultswap.io and you've confirmed that you're on the right site, then Corey's going to walk you through how to register to participate in the uh, uh, Safu Five. Yeah, absolutely, guys. So once you're at CatapultSwap.io, it's very simply, you're going to go to Bolt Power, which is the button in the middle. You're going to go to Launch Bolt Power on the left. And then you're going to go down. You're doing the Safu Fied Project, right? So that's what you're doing. You're registering there. So you're going to go all the way to the right, and you're going to click that down arrow. And then you're going to click the details button there. So it'll open up this screen. <clears throat> now, you want to connect your wallet. On the top of the right of the screen, it says connect wallet in gray with the white font. Whether you're using Trust Wallet, you'll use Wallet Connect, or you're using MetaMask. So I'm using MetaMask. And once I connect my wallet, you'll get a pop-up screen that you can't see on your screen right now, but you'll get a pop-up from your a MetaMask extension that says, uh, confirm the connection between Catapult Swap and connect it to uh, your MetaMask. And once you confirm that and your wallet is showing up in the top right, your wallet will show right here where it used to say connect wallet. That's when you'll come down to the middle to the right here um, and you'll see, I do want to participate, a little box to check. So once you check that box, you're gonna put in your name here, your email address and your phone number. 
this line here where it says wallet address one. Once your wallet address, once your wallet is connected, it will automatically populate here. Now, if you're taking care of family or you, you're running your sister's MetaMask, she's not into crypto, you're doing this for her, you will have an opportunity to connect her wallet address here as well. The, the stipulation here though, is you have to make sure that you go to your second wallet in your MetaMask pop-up, which you guys can't see on my screen, but if you have a second account, you're gonna switch over to that one you're going to click on wallet address two. You're going to click connect the wallet. It's going to show the next wallet address and that'll auto populate right in this second area here for you guys. So you can't just copy and paste into these spots because it will not let you. It's, it's based on a connection connectivity uh, mandatory process. So once you have your information here, um, you're going to fill out your information. You're going to click this little button that I agree and make sure here below it, you can, the pink writing, it says you must have at least $75 of True Badger tokens in any wallet you are registering. Um, you don't have to have it right now as you're registering for uh, the pre-registration, but you do have to have it by the time the swap happens on Tuesday, the pre-swap happens on Tuesday. Okay, so once you submit here, you're gonna get actually get a green light up up the top right that says you have successfully registered and then what you're gonna do right away is you're gonna to go to the left and you're gonna check your registration and you're gonna put in your email address that you just entered and you're gonna click submit. And if you do the correct one that I've already done, it'll say um, that it's sending you a verification code to that email. That email will come to that, uh, uh, the verification will come to that email it's a four digit code. Once you get that, you're gonna put it right in here and then it'll tell you that your registration is confirmed and it will take you to the next page where, let me see if I can do it again. Okay, um, I can probably do it again here. <clears throat> and once it takes you to the next page, it's, it's actually gonna give you um, the information that you filled out for you to verify, check that everything is absolutely correct. There will be a box to check at the bottom that says uh, it's a bit of a disclaimer and you're going to have to check that box and then submit. Once you're done, it's it. You're ready and registered to go for the pre-swap launch on Tuesday morning. All right. Awesome. Now, guys, uh, somebody had asked the great question. How do we acquire True Badger tokens? I'm going to tell you the best way to figure that out is to go to help.truebadger.com. Dot io, which is our help system that we built. It is a, it's videos, it is written, as well as the access to live Zoom people that will help get you through the process and put you into that. We're before, one of the only projects doing this. I don't, I don't mean to cut you off, Peter. I just want to make sure because there's, I'm getting inbox messages about that, as well as I'm reading the uh, the comments as well. Can you pull that link up, Corey? Yeah, he's so, going to pull yeah. it up. Right? So I was going to go through, um, and I'm going to pop it right back in the, uh, somebody just asked if this instructions were on YouTube. Um, I'll pop that in there for you guys too. Check the comments. And all the instructions, guys, too, are on the onboarding system. Even if you don't need help, you can go through it for free. And all the videos you need, depending on where you get involved with it, Corey will show you real quick. It's going to ask you what device you're using an Android and um, an Apple or a computer. It's going to ask if you have a wallet. If you do, you can put yes. It's going to take you to only if you need to buy BNB. &B. If you have, you know, a device and you have a wallet and you have crypto, um, it'll take you straight into being at how to buy in True Badger. So it's not going to take you through the whole thing. It's going to take you where you need to go when those questions that you answer and put this together. We usually don't cover a lot of this on these calls, guys, but it, there is the timeline for Saturday night. Um, and we want to get people involved as many people as possible. And network is um, as powerful as the size of its early community getting started. So we want as many people to participate as possible. Um, there's no requirement. You can buy True Badger and not participate in this. 
You can decide to wait and see what happens and participate in the next one. I'm not putting any pressure on anybody to get involved. We just want to give people the opportunity as best as possible to become part of what we're doing and where we're headed to. So this will take you through this. At any time when you're here, uh, and Corey already hit it, it says already asked for help. Before that, it says I'm stuck. I need help. Uh, you can click on that button right there. And this is going to take you into a live. Now, some of you guys in the U.S., you're going, well, yeah, but tomorrow's uh, Thanksgiving. And um, there will actually be some agents working tomorrow. They're Canadians, so they're not going to be celebrating uh, Thanksgiving there. So they will be on tomorrow. So after you eat your turkey and you take your nap, your normal nap, watch your football game, and you said, you know what, I want to try to get started, you can jump in and see if they're available to help walk you through the process there to get that going. But they'll be available Friday, Saturday, and we are open. There are agents available on Sunday as well to get you and walk you through that process. Now, if you don't get registered by Saturday at 1159, you can still participate in our phase two. There's two phases that go on Catapult. The first phase, and then there's a second phase. You would not be able to participate in the first phase, but you could in the second phase. And again, I don't want to confuse you guys. So if it's Saturday, you know, or Sunday and you, oh, I went to forgot, there's still an opportunity for you to get in early enough before it goes to pancake swap and then starts to get those rises that you've seen in the other side of this thing. We've been working with a lot of great leaders like Cedric that are just incredible. They've, they, they've just become masters at building teams and leadership and helping people. Um, so Cedric and several other ones that we're working with. Um, and we believe that the possibility exists that in the next six to eight weeks, we will bring over 20,000 new people through this entire system. We've also partnered with one of the top internet marketing people in the country that drive traffic. They're going to begin to start driving traffic through this funnel, as well as we've hired a PR firm on that over the next three months will get us about 15 to 20 different publications, crypto publications, non-crypto publications. Um, so these are some of the things that are happening for us to drive these brands. And of course, as soon as NSI goes on the marketplace on the first and people see the power of that software, they're going to flock into that. And that's going to grow tremendously uh, over the next short period of time. Um, this will be, we won't do any more token launches in December, but we will have some NFT launches that we'll be working on uh, through that process. Um, so those are some of the things that are going on to put us through there. We told everybody about 45 minutes, Cedric. I think we're at that right now. So do you want to take a couple of questions or you want to just, you know, set up another call maybe we could do over the weekend? I would be available if you want to do something like that. It's totally up to you on what you'd like to do. Sure. I want to hit a couple of quick things here really quickly because I know it's the day before Turkey Day. So number one, there's quite a few of you that are like, hey, how do I get True Badger tokens? Okay. Yes, you want to have $75 worth of True Badger tokens for this launch. Help.truebadger.io. When we say there's live Zoom rooms, there are live Zoom rooms. One of my great friends was actually here at my home on yesterday. And I'm going to tell a quick story so some of y'all get it because he's actually on here. And I'm sure he won't, he won't mind me telling the story. He actually uh, downloaded a pancake swap app. There is no pancake swap app. Did y'all hear that? There is no pancake swap app. He downloaded a pancake swap app. All of his coins got zapped out of his wallet. Okay. He went into the live Zoom room. He went into the live Zoom room and they walked him through how to get everything set up. It literally took him about 10 minutes. Okay. And let me tell you how important this is because a lot of people will ask questions before looking for the information. They will ask questions before looking for the information. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the crypto space. There's going to be a couple of things that you want to learn. On the same token, though, when you are in a position to have a company that has full-blown live Zoom rooms, whether you are an expert in crypto, whether you can't even spell crypto, to be able to walk you through A, B, C, D, E, F, G on what to do, that, my friends, is so invaluable. So for those of you that are asking, how do I do this? How do I do that? help.truebadger.io. 
That's number one, okay? Secondly, there is a live, you, we have a live YouTube video, okay? Corey posted a lot of this, Corey posted all of this inside of the chat section for those of you, so make sure that you click it. But there's a, a YouTube video that we have already live that walks you through step-by-step step what Corey just did. Some of you might think that, okay, he went a little fast. Okay, we have a full-blown 30-minute YouTube video that will walk you through how to register for this launch, step-by-step, step, okay? Now, a lot of you know we launched a crypto Facebook group a little over a week ago. I think it's about nine days old. In nine days, that crypto private Facebook group has 962 wow. active people in it in nine days. I didn't say 90, nine in nine days. If you are not inside of this Facebook group, I'm going to highly, highly suggest that you send me an inbox message or you send someone who introduced you to this Zoom that is inside of that Facebook group an inbox message. Say, hey, I need that link to that specific Facebook group because we are posting that information inside of that Facebook group. I will post this live Zoom in there tonight. I'm gonna to post it in there tonight once this is rendered, okay? Next thing, all of you have a telephone, okay? Make sure that you get our Telegram group, okay? True Badger has a live Telegram group that has a significant amount of information to keep you up to speed on what's going on inside of the, inside of the whole community. I don't want people to procrastinate, pacificate, Meditate, now I know I've got an English major or two, so pacificate is not a word, just bear with me, Don King is my cousin. Do not procrastinate, meditate, or pacificate. Some of you might wanna wait and wait, well, I'll get around to it later. And I can tell you right now, procrastination in the crypto space can be expensive. Some of you have already realized this based upon what's been going on inside of our group. So if you know that it's gonna take you 20 minutes to do something, set aside that 20 minutes. Saturday night, 11.59 Eastern Standard Time. Now, you want to be a part of phase one. Yes, there will be a, a replay for the Zoom, Charles, inside of our private group. You want to be a part of phase one. So set aside those 20 minutes and 30 minutes and walk through this. And anything that you need help with, you've got the Telegram group and you've got help.truebadger.io. I've been a part of a significant amount of projects in the crypto space since 2017. And I've never been a part of a project that has live Zoom rooms that are walking you through how to do something. Typically, you gotta figure it out on your own. And a lot of people don't like to figure out things because we live in an instant gratification society. The worst thing that was ever made on this planet was a microwave. The best thing that was ever made on this planet was a microwave. If you don't believe me, look at your microwave right now. There's still 27 seconds left on your microwave right now because your son couldn't wait two minutes for the hot pocket to get done. Everybody wants instant gratification. So it has to take us a little bit of time to go through this. It might take you 20 minutes or 30 minutes. It's worth the time. There's 148 of you on here right now. There's a reason why you are here. Take advantage of that moment. Take advantage of that moment. So yes, the details will be inside of the Facebook group. The live YouTube video will be inside of the Facebook group. The Telegram link will be inside of the Facebook group. The help.truebadger.io will be inside of the Facebook group. You see it inside of the chat section right now. The recording of this video will be inside of the Facebook group, okay? Everything that you need. And we've got leaders from the project inside of the Facebook group as well. So we're giving you everything on a silver platter. You just have to be smart enough to take action. Now, I've got to throw this in here really quickly because my attorney is on here as well because he's always on everything that I do. I am not a financial advisor. I am not giving you financial advice and neither is Peter. Always make sure that you do your own research when you're looking at any project inside of the crypto space. However, if you don't think that what we're doing right now is super solid, I want you to take a mirror, stick it under your nose and make sure that you fog it up. <laughs> if you fog it up, you know that you're in the right place. All righty, everybody good, everybody with me? Now there's, a, there's some questions in here. I think we answered uh, majority of them. A lot of you are asking me inside of the, the section. I can't go through right now and add you to the Facebook group from this particular uh, video because there's a significant amount of you in here. So please send me an inbox message. Find me on Facebook. We're probably already friends or get with someone 
who is a part of our community so we can get you inside of our particular group. So I think, I think we're good, Peter. I, I, I really truly, we're like right at the top of the hour. And I know that so many people have their family. They wanna do the turkey thing. I don't want any burnt pumpkin pies out there. I don't wanna see any bad Facebook pics of burnt turkeys because they were on a, a, a Zoom with us, okay? Joe, I appreciate you. Ladies and gentlemen, Joe Jackson, my friend, my business partners, he's one of the, he's actually the reason why all of you are here right now because he was persistent enough to keep calling and calling and calling and calling. Y'all let me know when y'all get to hang out. And calling and calling and calling because this is not network marketing, but we understand smart business. Okay, so whenever you meet my man Joe Jackson, you know, send him a cake or something, you know, send him some pound cake. Some of y'all got some pumpkin pies, mail my man a piece of pumpkin pie or something, because that's the reason why you're here today. Corey, thank you so much for everything that you do, brother. I appreciate you. Thank Cedric, you. Cedric, there's I'm one sorry. better way they can thank him than giving him pie, because he's okay. got to stay in shape, right? That is to share this with somebody you know and get them involved in this project. He's got a lot of crypto in his wallet. So he's just think he'll buy his own pie. That's right. <laughs> That's right. That's right. And listen, everybody think about it this way. A rising tide raises all ships. Remember that a rising tide raises all ships. Don't take valuable information like this and hoard it. God did not put you on this planet to hoard valuable information. If you ever want to be successful in anything in life, learn to give. Learn to take from yourself, take it off of you and give and stop expecting something in return. Because if you give and give and give and give and give and keep on giving, it will come back 20 fold. OK, it will come back 20 fold. So share it with your mother, your sister, your brother, your uncle. They, they don't know anything about crypto. They don't understand MetaMask. They don't know this. They don't know that. We've got YouTube videos for it. We've got a Facebook group for it. We've got support to help everyone. That's what we're doing inside of this Facebook group. I know a lot of you already appreciate that because we're all about value, value, value. So let's serve, let's help as many people as we possibly can because these projects here, ladies and gentlemen, are sexy and you are learning about it before it hits pancake swap. Did you hear that? Before it hits the swap, you're on the Zoom. You had the foresight to get on the Zoom before it hit the swap. Take advantage of that because I know way too many people that their lives have changed because they got involved in something before it hit the swap because things get ballistic after that. You've already seen it charts before. The proof is in the pudding, okay? So Peter, thank you so much. Thank, thank you. you, Corey. Thank you, Joe. Thank you, everybody that's on the Zoom. We appreciate you. We appreciate the trust that you've given us. Once this video is rendered, I will definitely post it up. With that being said, happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Be safe out there. Enjoy your families. And we look forward to seeing you all on the other side. God bless you all. Have a great night. God bless. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Happy Thanksgiving.